Hey everybody, this is Nancy again. Um, please excuse my voice. I have a bit of a cold right now. Um, this is a journal that I made with digitals that I put together myself. Um, I use digi digitals from Old Design Shop, I believe is the name of it, and Graphics Fairy, and other uh, public domain or free to use um, printables that I put together just to make some cute pictures to make a little journal. Um, I, I tied this together with sorry silk that I've got from Victorian Gypsy on Etsy. And just various pieces of lace. This is embroidery. Can you see that? And lace. And a doily. And I had these in my stash. I don't remember where I got them. And this is just lace that I curled around and used Fabri-Tac to glue it on a piece of cardboard. And then I put a button in the middle. And um, this is where my sewing machine kept messing up. And I liked the way it looked, so I did it a lot more. <laughs> and so... Um, this is a doily on the back and, and a piece of embroidery and um, embroidery and lace. And these are just lace um, fabric and tool um, ruffles that I put on the side. I just thought this girl was gorgeous. I kind of changed the color on her and worked on her so that she would match the pinks that I was using in this journal and I put a background on her. I I'm, I kind of played with this um, digital um, of this sweet little girl. So um, I'm going to go on the inside. Um, this is just a little fabric collage piece I did with burlap and fabric and um, cheesecloth, lace, um, a button, just different pieces. This is trim from Gale. I bought this digital from Gale uh, Cinnamon Tea on Etsy, and I'll link her below. Um, these little cards. This is supposed to look like a paper bag, crinkled like paper bag or a crinkled brown paper backing. And these are the digitals I did myself. And then it has coffee dyed paper on the back. These are more I worked on myself. Um, this is one that came from a free download, I think. Um, it says, Flower Children, Peonies, a charming lady. She doesn't like a spot too shady. Likes to live out in the white, dressed in red or pink or white. And I can't remember where I got that from. But it was um, a download. Um, there's another pretty little girl. And these, um, these, this is a Patricia pocket. And these trims are from, are Gail's Digitals. And then this is another one I made. And another one I made. Okay, and then I just have them tucked in this, um, this book page pocket, like I got the idea from that Patricia's videos. So these all go in this little pocket. Then I have this sweet little girl, and then this collage up here. Would you call it a snippet? I don't know what they're called. Um, these have little pieces of lace, and there's the peony girl. I just love peonies. And I couldn't find any kits that just had peonies, so I just kind of made my own. This paper is a digital download, digital download from, I think it's Taylor Journals or Taylor Made Journals. I'll have to link her below, but it's a, a digital on Etsy. And I want to try the avocado dyeing, but I loved her digital. She has also has avocado and coffee together. Um, a digital. 
download. It's also very pretty, and I decided on this one because it was a little bit more pink. This is just paper for journaling, more of the avocado dyed paper. And then this sweet little girl, she's holding her dolly. And then more of the avocado dyed digital and coffee dyed paper. And um, these pages with the paper bag are ones I made. Here's another page like I made and then um, this one I made from digitals and more of the avocado paper and this is just um, I believe it's muslin it may be cotton at the top I have pieces of both so I, I can't remember which one that is um, these are just real pretty lace I just love these little girls and I sewed around them I don't know if you can see there's everything sewed with gold metallic thread so it glistens so I love that thread so much so pretty all these pages have stenciling I love this little girl I played with her the colors of her as well um, and then this is a page that I made and then it just has lace glued on the bottom and a doily go through this quickly so I don't bore everybody but that's another page that I made with a doily and this is the avocado dyed paper digital this is another page that I did on the it has lace and you can see the little I don't know if you can see it on the camera there's like netting behind the flowers and lace like the lace that has the netting and then the gold thread is down the middle again another collage and a peony I just love them They're so pretty I love roses too but I love the peonies and this, I used some metallic um, trim, Christmas trim that I had. And I just thought it went with the gold thread. It really sparkles. Um, there's another one of the background pages I made. And I got this from online. And um, just another little collage. Here's another one of the gold trims. I just thought it went real well with the book. I'm starting to lose my voice, guys. I'm sorry. Um, another background page I made with the lace look on the side. And I thought this little girl was so cute with her dolly. And she has peonies behind her. And that's another background page that I did. Sorry, I've got it shaded. An avocado dyed paper from that digital. Um, here's another page. It's got book page ruffled here. Um, the peony background that I did. And the digitals that I'll link below. And more a tag that I made. I did the digital. And it's coffee dyed paper on the back of all of the tags. another peony page and then here's just a fabric cluster um, lace and fabric and um, eyelash trim and burlap and I was gonna make it a tuck but then I was afraid the burlap would come apart so I just glued it all down and here's another peony page and here's the back pocket in the back pocket there's a book page and fabric um, collage some of Gail's trim um, more of the peony pictures and another tag 
with coffee dyed paper. And I love Gail's trim on here, the digital trim. So, and that's another Patricia pocket and more pink lace. And then I just had it tied around with this sorry silk. So, um, please like and subscribe, ring the little bell, and um, help support my channel. Um, thank you for all your kind comments. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.